black pig lay at anchor in Bumble Buzz Bay. Captain Pugwash was delighted that he had stocked up on pots and pots of his favorite wild bee honey. Meanwhile, Jonah was inspired to take up a new hobby strictly on the quad. He made every attempt to smuggle the equipment down to his workshop, but his secret enterprise had been rumbled from afar. Aha! Well, I'll be jiggered if it's not that big fella smuggling some treasure on board the Black Pig. Well, treasure, boss. That's what I said. And very shifty he looks. What sort of treasure? A big thing. Ah, oh, a thing, a big thing. Ah, oh, beauty, oh, right? That's the sort of treasure we like, boy. I should say so. And that's the sort of treasure we're going to get. Delicious honey. What a top hole idea it was of mine to call in at Bumble Buzz Bay. Top hole indeed, Captain. Nothing like honey straight from the bee. Well, there's Marmite. Well, Marmite doesn't come from bees, Willie. Oh, no, that, that's true. Well, pass me another sandwich, Tom. I suppose Marmite comes from mites. <laughs> Don't witter, Willie. Jonah hasn't had any tea, Captain. Well, he obviously didn't want any, Tom. But I must say, I think I could manage a couple more. I don't want to wake up hungry in the middle of the night. I'll go and make some more, Captain. <laughs> Shh! Stop buzzing, huh? You're so cute! You're my little secret. Jonah? Huh? Why are you wearing beekeeping clothes? Ah, they, they belong to my great-uncle Joshua. <laughs> cool, eh? What are you hiding? <gasps> Oh, Jonah, you can't have bees on board. But I like them. It might upset the captain. The captain don't have to know. Know what I mean. Oh, Jonah. Eh, but I can make my own honey now. We can all have honey. Honey for breakfast, honey for lunch, honey for tea, and honey for supper. Oh, man. He was once stuck on the nose, may he be, and it swelled up like a plum tomato. Like a plum? Tomato. What, the bee? No, my nose. Oh, heck. Brave though one is, one doesn't relish coming face to face with a bee. Never mind a swarm of the blighters. Are there killer bees in Bumblebuzz Bay? <laughs> killer bees? No, no. The Bumblebuzz babies are really friendly. Uh, they are no trouble. Know what I mean. They only get angry and swarm if you scare them. They are really cuddly little things. Well, I heard they were killer bees. Nonsense, <laughs> Willie. <laughs> but since you're all so frightened of bees, it's, it's, it's my duty as captain to order that we set sail from Bumble Buzz Bay at first light before any of the little blighters get the idea of boarding our ship. <laughs> oh. No, listen carefully. I have a plan. We lay low here until nightfall. Oh, boy. Until nightfall? Listen. Then we get in the long boat and we glides alongside the black pig. Glides along the pig. And we creep aboard. Sure thing, boy. We sneak through the galley. Through the galley? Down the stairs. Down the stairs. Then we snatch the big treasure thing. Snatch it. We snatch the thing. Jonah, the bees will have to go. Oh, man, I love them. If you love them, then we should take them back to the shore. Ah, but they are happy here. Look, buzz, buzz, buzz. But the captain won't be happy. Oh, I'll keep them safe down here, man. Jonah, the life of a pirate's no life for a bee. They need plants and flowers. I can grow plants and flowers. But they'll probably get seasick. Oh, you think so? Uh-huh. Oh, man. Bees need fresh air and sunshine. They do? Uh-huh. Or they might get the scurvy. Ah, that's not good. Or rabies. Ah, rabies? Then they could die. Oh, they won't like that. Come on, everyone's asleep. Let's get this hive up on deck and into the rowing boat. We can row them back to shore and the captain will never know anything about it. Steady, Jonah. Now, put it down here. I'll get the boat ready. Now then, get those grappling irons ready. Right, you ass, boss. Shh. Then, onto the black pig we go. Did you hear that? 
I did. It's cutthroat, Jake. It is. Duck down. See, boys. What? Uh, will we fit the big thing in this boat? Of course we will. But it's a big thing. It's not that big a big thing. What? It's only a little big thing. Quiet. Ooh. Oh. Wait till the moon goes behind that cloud. Then on we go. Jake must be after your hive. Oh, no, man. What do we do? I know. Why don't we paint honey in a circle around the hive? Then, when they try to steal it, they'll all get stuck. Plittering <coughs> collywobbles. I'm starving. Uh, couldn't have fancy another honey sandwich. Hmm. I wonder. I feel a little trip to the galley coming on. That should be enough honey to do the trick, Jonah. Now, you bungle brain beesums, onto the black pig. Here they come, Jonah. Quick, hide over here. Oh. Oh. No good will come of this. Mark my words. Oh, oh no, the captain. Blistery barnacles. What on earth? It's a hive. It's a, 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 a beehive. Ooh, top, top. Bees on board. Bees on board, boy. Sound the alarm. Hoist the doodah. Top, top. Yeah. <laughs> We're not bees, Pugwash. You old dingbat. We're bigger than bees. <laughs> We're a much sharper sting. <laughs> Oh, this is the big thing, boys. There's the treasure. <laughs> Come on, you lot, forward! <laughs> the bees are going to swarm. <laughs> I can't move. I'm stuck to the floor. Oh, me too, boys. That'll teach Cutthroat Jake not to bring bees onto my ship. Oh, yes, Captain. <laughs> A very bad man. <laughs> Mark my words. Eh? Tom, get rid of him. Chase him off. And those wretched bees. Yes, Captain. Um... But they're stuck to the deck, Captain. We'll unstick them. Oh, all right. Aha! Uh -huh. Jonah, get ready to grab some pairs of water. And when I give the word... Okay, Tom. Jake, you scoundrel! They've gone now, Captain. Oh, but what about the bees? They're in this honey jar, Captain. <sighs> and Jonah and I will take them ashore first thing in the morning. Uh, well, just mind you do. Make sure you leave enough honey sandwiches for my breakfast. Aye, Captain. So, there I was, my hearties. Taking the air on deck when suddenly a cutthroat Jake sprang aboard with a hive of killer bees. Oh, heck. Oh, heck, indeed, Willie. But I was ready for them. I had a top hole plan. Mm. Now, what I decided to do. I'm glad the bees are safely back in Bumblebuzz Bay, Jonah. Hey, me too. So, no more bees on board? We don't want to upset the captain. Mm, that's true, Tom. I was remarkably courageous, I can tell you. Because after that, you see, the bees began to swarm. Oh, Captain, you must have been so frightened. Uh, nonsense, Willie. <laughs> I, Captain Horatio Pugwash, frightened. <laughs> I think we'll wait here for a bit longer, Jonah. Don't you? Oh, yes. Don't want to upset the captain. <laughs> I drew my cutlass and, well, you should have seen Jake quiver. Yes, sir. 
You're brave, Captain. Oh, oh Captain, say Captain. That's what captains are for, Mr. Ma Ma Mr. Mr. Ma Mr. <laughs> Tom Judah. There you are. Our sandwich, Captain. Don't mind if I do. 